So, hey guys, it's Sherri Ann Richardson, and it's been a while since I've done a live video. Um, and I hadn't quite intended to do this like this, but my mailman just dropped this off, and he set it in a very wet, muddy area outside instead of bringing it up to the door like he should have. So, I didn't want to put it on the carpet or on the furniture. Um, hello, Rachel. Uh, hi, Wanda. So anyway, this is this. There's a story behind this, and I'm going to tell you the story after I get done. But what is inside of this box, or at least what's supposed to be inside of this box, um, is something that is very old and that I've been on the hunt for. So I'm going to attempt to carefully open this box. Um, I'm absolutely amazed that I found this in all original condition. Um, but like I said, I, I think getting into the box is going to be a lot of fun. I did not try to pre-open this, and maybe I should have. Um, she told me it was going to be a really big box, and because I was too young to remember what the original box looked like, um, I knew the size of what's inside, but I didn't know the size of the box. So, I guess I should have expected this. Um, box back out here because I guess you guys are seeing the back. This is the Raggedy Ann doll that I had when I was maybe a year, two years old. And I have been on the hunt for the exact doll. I found a lady that, I have another helper coming here, um, that had one. And I was amazed when she told me she had the box. Okay, I see the box is okay. The box was just bent inward um, because it's open. And this is probably from 1970, 71, 72, somewhere in that age range. And what really, really impressed me this she still has the tag attached to her this is the tag that in the photograph that I have that was clearly on my doll <laughs> I have a lot of helpers here and like I said I am absolutely amazed that I was able to find her yes it is a great find I mean look look at what good condition she's in she has a little bit of yellowing on the pants, but not bad at all. And to come with the original box and everything, I'm going to set her up here. Um, and so now I'm going to share the story with you. When I was given this doll, I don't know if I was one or two, but I was very young. And I had her for many, many years, um, up until I was at least nine years old. She was my favorite doll, and of course I slept with her every night. And when I was nine, right before school started in August, um, my Grandpa King passed away. And that was a huge, huge turning point in my life. Um, I'm not sure what made the next events happen, but my Raggedy Ann doll was taken away by my mother. This doll, um, not this exact doll, but this, this is a replica of the exact doll, um, was taken away by my mother and taken to 
a burn pile out on our backyard and she made me stand in my bedroom window and watch as my stepdad Larry threw her on the fire and as she burned up. All of my stuffed animals were taken out of my room that day along with I honestly can't remember what else. The Raggedy Ann was the most hurtful to be taken away because mine was in really good shape. My tag was missing, but the rest of my Raggedy Ann was in as good a shape as this one because, like I said, she was my favorite doll and I always took care of her. I don't know what happened to the other Raggedy Ann and Andes that I had, but this is the one that I remember and this is the one that I've been on the hunt for. And I am so thankful that I saw the lady post this up on Facebook and that I was the one that was able to get her. Um, like I said, the fact that the tag is still attached, the fact that she still had the box, it's just amazing. And she will be going upstairs in my Raggedy Ann room as soon as we're done with it. And I just, I absolutely love her. So... Anyway, guys, I, I really wanted to share this unboxing with you because she's absolutely perfect and exactly what I was looking for. So, and to everybody that has helped me find Raggedy Ann items, because I know a lot of you have, um, a lot of you have sent me stuff. Thank you so, so much. It's all going to go up in that room, and I love all of it. So, I hope all of you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you later. Bye.